Alright, in this video we're going to go over the disassembly of the HK USP handgun. As with handling any firearm, first thing we do is we check to make sure it's unloaded. Go ahead and grasp the slurations on the rear of the slide. Rack the weapon to the rear. We can see that the chamber is empty. We're going to drop the magazine by depressing the magazine release at the bottom rear of the trigger guard. The magazine comes out. We can see that's empty. The weapon's unloaded and we can begin to assemble it. Now the HK USP can be disassembled um, whether in safe or fire and with the hammer either back or down. So what we're going to do is we're going to keep the hammer to the rear and put the safety on. Now, to remove the upper assembly with the slide, the barrel, the recoil spring from the lower frame assembly, what we need to do is we need to line up this square cut at the bottom of the slide right above this pin in the slide stop. That cutout will correspond with a little metal cutout with that slide stop. Then, once we've lined that up, we're going to push this pin on the right side of the frame through to the left side, and that will remove the entire slide stop assembly. So again, rack the weapon slightly. I grab the top of the slide over and use my thumb to push against the trigger guard. Once you see that that's lined up, push in with your right finger on the pin on the other side of the frame. The slide stop will start to lift out, and you can go ahead and pick the slide stop out of the weapon and set it aside. Now, the slide and the upper assembly will just run right off the front of the gun. For the lower assembly, there shouldn't be too much cleaning you're going to need to do. You may want to clean up around the trigger magazine slide area here along the rails. Um, lubricate the little metal rails there into the polymer frame. Um, but don't mess with the trigger assembly in case you're exceedingly confident what you're doing. Otherwise, there shouldn't be too much work you need to do with the lower frame assembly. Go ahead and set that aside. To remove the recoil spring assembly, simply take your finger on the back of the recoil rod and pull away slightly. The rod will pop out just a bit. You can see that the guide rod and the recoil spring assembly stays together one unit. You won't need to clean this too much, so there should be too much gunpowder residue on this. If there is, just go ahead and wipe it up with a Q-tip, whatever it is you're using. Set that aside. The barrel, typical behind action, just push forward, grab the locking lugs, and then rotate out the bottom of the slot. For the barrel, typical, just use a boar snake, cleaning rod, whatever it is that you use to clean on the inside of the barrels. Clean up on the uh, the face of the barrel here, especially on the feed ramp area, and that'll be all you'll need to do with that. There shouldn't be too much lubrication needed around the, uh, the lugs of the barrel. With the slide, this is now the bare slide. You don't need to worry about the firing pin area. Just go ahead and push on the back of the firing pin. Make sure you still get a little bit of uh, movement there. That's not gummed up too quickly. Clean up on the uh, front of the chamber face right there where the uh, firing pin is. Um, on the inside of the slide here, you may get a little bit of gunpowder residue, um, but there shouldn't be too much there. The, uh, the uh, safety right here next to the firing pin block, go ahead and clean up there. Make sure that that moves freely, and that'll be all you'll need to do. And that is the disassembly and field strip of an HK USP handgun.